Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Red. In the last episode, we were taking on these people on Nugget Bridge, and we are going to be continuing to do that. No, I'm not getting tired being I just walk back and heal. Just saying. So, in the last episode, I'm aware there was some sort of freaking weird, um, which video something. So, also, if the levels look different, that's just because with all the crap that was been happening with all the audio and video issues. So, as you can see, we finally have a move on Spashy. Thank freaking God. So, what, what, was, what is this? A Pidgey? Actually, let's see if Spashy can take it out. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, no, that's not going to happen anytime soon. Okay. Especially if you're going to start shooting us with um, sand, we're going to get Spashy out of there. So hopefully after we battle these trainers here, we'll be a high enough level to take on Misty and finally continue on because we have been here way too whoa, long. Try confusion. Come on. So yeah, um, hopefully the audio, the video issue won't happen again and I would have fixed it however. What do you mean my attack missed? Oh, because you're using sand attack. God damn you, Pidgey! No, but um, I didn't actually realize what had happened until after it had rendered out and all that because it wasn't in there during editing, so... It just makes me a little pissed, but hey, we'll get on with it. So, we're still trying to take out this Pidgey, and I've just decided to go with my normal tactic when a Pokemon is being annoying for me, is just burn the hell out of it. And that works really well for us, so I'm going to continue to do that while... So what else have you got? 61, 61, 61! Use Nidoran. I think that's a female symbol, I do not know. So we're going to switch out again, we'll go into Pidgey. What is it? Is that female? I think that's a female symbol. But they so look like guinea pigs, look at them. With pointy horns on its ears and everywhere else. They, they look adorable, but then they evolve into this huge, huge, not so adorable Pokemon. Oh, it uses a move, but I think we can take it out here with Pidgey, so we're just going to leave Pidgey in, which is actually higher level than what I remember it to be, but that may be because of all the different tries I've had at this, so we will continue to don't do that. Don't do that. Thank God, if that had poisoned, I would have not been impressed. Take it out. Oh, come on. No. Sometimes I just want to strangle some of these Pokemon trainers just so I can win, but that's such a shame. Oh, finally, we took it out. What else have we got? Was that the last Oh, no, that was the last one. Yeah, we defeated you. Yeah, you lost too. Of course you did. Alrighty, so I'll be heal up and we'll be back in a sec. Alrighty, so we are back and we have one more trainer to take on to have beaten Nugget Bridge and he is a very violent man, apparently. Oh, not a man, it's a child. Okay, a very violent child then. And all, it only has a manky in time. Look at the manky, look at it. It's like it's scratching its ears. I know, I really shouldn't comment on the sprites, but it's become something I do now, so... This is our first encounter with a Mankey, and, you know, it looks like a Mankey. It just looks like... it doesn't look as, you know, vicious as Mankeys normally are, but... Oh, it's gonna use a Karate Chop, and no, no, no! Don't take this out! That's it, confuse it, confuse it! Oh, it's super effective! Thank oh, now oh, it's gonna use Lair. Okay, so we should be able to take it out with Butterfree. Which is good, because Butterfree's probably... is the lowest at the moment, I believe, so... Also, I wanted to learn, I think it learns Poison Sting soon, so that'll be helpful, because then we can confuse and poison our enemies. Oh, we took the Mankey out. 142. And we haven't grown a level yet. Damn it. You were too easy. Yeah, how come you were last? You were really too easy. Alright, so I'm going to just quickly heal and we'll go up and see, get our glorious prize. Okay, so we are back, and now we are going to talk to this guy who better give us our prize. We did. I beat your five contestant trainers. Trainers. Trainers, quite easily. If 
fabulous prize and we receive a nugget. Would you like to join Team Rocket? What? To the to evil. Oh, wow. I like the fact that it's funny how they don't actually give us an option whether we want to join or not because I have a feeling that there would be a lot of people who would say yes and they don't really want you to say yes because, you know, we're not supposed to be joining Team Rocket. Although that would make for a good, um, I guess a good small side game. You play as a Team Rocket member trying to take out trainers like this and become head of Team Rocket or something like that. Just an idea, but it would be a pretty good game, I think. I think a lot of people would like it too, because I know a lot of people would like to play as a Team Rocket. And maybe give Team Rocket some sort of fighting chance of being good. Uh, we'll go into Butterfree again, because I want Butterfree to level up a bit. And it's a closer level, so we'll go into Butterfree here. Don't poison us. Alright, we'll just use the confusion and probably get Butterfree out of there, because... Oh! No, we won't. Oh, don't use rap. Damn you, Ekans. Okay, so we have to now wait for the Ekans attack to... F oh, still going, are you? Okay. Come up. Yep, oh, oh, come on. Just let me have a move. Apparently not. Come on, Butterfree. What were you doing so low to the ground for an Ekans to get you? Really? There we go, we took it out anyway. 99 red balloons. Now I'm not going to start singing. That would not be pleasant for anyone. There we go. Now we learn poison powers, so we can now poison people. And you're about to not a Zubat. Yes, I am going to change it. Let's go. Let's go into Pidgey. There's no real point trying to level Charmeleon up because it's going to be useless against the Misty, so we'll try and level these ones up here so that we have some sort of fighting chance against Misty. Oh, it's going to use Leech Life, which is probably not going to be too effective. No, it's not. One. <laughs> it's not going to help it much, so we'll use Quick Attack again and... Oh, we got a critical. Thank God. Wait. Oh, I thought I'd taken it out. I hate that. You can't actually see that small little 1 HP there. Sneaky little Zubat. So, there we go. We defeated Rocket. I love how the... I was going to do the voice there, but I thought, I'd better not. You could become a top leader in Team Rocket. I could, but I'm not going to. So we're off to become a Pokemon master, because that's what we're going to do. Alrighty, so I'm going to heal up and we're going to take stock of what we've got and the levels, and I'm going to see whether we th I think we'd be up to it, because we think Staryu was level 18, Star me was level 21, I think. I might deposit Ekans into the PC too, because we're never going to use it. Ever. <laughs> Probably just going to stay as a level 10. Oh, hello. Out of my way. Important Pokemon business. Someone's PC. Oh yeah, we all have to do that too, up the top. Because that's actually Bill's PC. We're going to deposit a Pokemon. I'm going to deposit you, probably never to see the light of day again. Sorry. See ya. No, I'll press the wrong button. Come on, out, out. Alrighty, so. Let's have a look at our Pokemon. Level 15, 20, 15, 17. So I'm probably going to want them at a little higher level. Um, oh, we've got five potions, which will be helpful. And now we've got the Nugget 2. Oh, this isn't the time to use that. Well, I thought I would try anyway. Alrighty, so I think we're going to leave it there. I'm going to do a bit of off-screen training, and I'll see you all next time where we will take on and hopefully defeat Misty, the gym leader. So see you guys later.